I can't say it because I have to crop it out. <laughs> okay. I think you should do those things where you put like a random sound effect over it, like a like. Beeple. But you should you should pick a really niche one, like like uh, like a like Nicki Webster thing. going, kick kisses. <laughs> Or me impersonating the QFC. I'll just put that, that little audio. <laughs> is it? Hello? Your car's going forward, your car's going forward. I'm, my foot is on the brake. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> just happened. Merry Christmas. Hi! <laughs> Hi! Um, I have a guest here, Gabby, and I'm Tash. Welcome to my channel. Today, we're going to be trying... Um, like the Starbucks drinks, I guess. <laughs> the holiday ones, so... Yeah. I don't know what's the best way to go about this. I have no assistance for you, I don't know. I reckon I really want to try this gingerbread latte one first, because it smells like... Kick kisses! <laughs> <laughs> so... Can't wait for you to get a brand deal with Starbucks. Australian Starbucks is really... Kick kisses! Unless they decide to sponsor me, then I didn't say that. <laughs> Alright. Should I take a lid off or should I just drink it? No, no. Do you? It smells awful. I genuinely am. What the heck? <laughs> what does that say though? It is a matcha! <laughs> what the? Kick kisses. Ew. It smells like seaweed. It's literally. But it says gingerbread. I can't even show it to you. I'll show you the lid. It's a matcha. <laughs> but it says <laughs> on the back. On the Gingerbread latte with almond milk and cream. That is so weird. I have no interest in putting yeah, that in my mouth. Yeah, that's not. That's well, that's awesome. That's not it. <laughs> what the? <laughs> kick kisses. Do you want to go back? Maybe we'll go back afterward. Yeah. We'll, like... we'll try these first, and then I'll be like, "Sorry, what do you think this is?" Yeah. Okay. Well, that's off to a really good start. That's so wild. How did they do that so wrong? Okay. Oh, and I also wanted to read out the little things. I guess it doesn't really matter about the gingerbread one. Can you read out the matcha just to... The matcha. <laughs> All right. The Japanese tea ceremony emphasizes the virtues of humility, restraint, and simplicity. It's practice governed by a set of highly ritualized actions, but this smooth and creamy matcha-based beverage can be enjoyed any way you like. So by all means, slurp away if you want to. Way, I don't. <laughs> don't want the to. way I would like to enjoy it is if it was made of gingerbread and coffee, <laughs> not if it was made of green tea. <laughs> also, do you like my Christmas nails? Oh, they're really fun. They're a nice color. I do they match them. my matcha. <laughs> that we didn't order. <laughs> Alright, which one do you want to have next? Toffee nut or peppermint? Up to you. Um, let's do the toffee nut. Oh, I'll read my little thing. I feel like you won't be able to taste much after the peppermint. But... Yeah, that's what I'm worried about. Do you want to try the matcha? Um, yeah, not just, really, you but... You just do it. I just... I, it smells like the sea. <laughs> mm. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so this is the toffee nut one. It looks correct. So, I don't think we're going to have any surprises there. Yeah, no, it doesn't look green, so that's and, a really um, good start. Will you hold this on display while I read out the beautiful... Sure. Okay. <clears throat> Shots of rich espresso dance together with the heartwarming flavours of buttery toffee, which are delicately balanced by notes of toasted nuts. The crescendo is a crown of whipped cream picked, sprinkled in a sweet, crunchy topping. Sip it hot, iced, or have it blended for a creamy, Christmassy treat. Do the people at Starbucks know what crescendo means? Why <laughs> they use it in a non-musical sentence? I can't wait. That is delicious. It's good. We got... Do you want to open a straw? Um... We got them with almond milk as well because. Oh, my pants. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good. And they've done a good one today as well. Mm, that is nice. I like that crunchy stuff too. It really is dancing my mouth. <laughs> the crescendo. <laughs> Yum. It's really good. Yeah, I'm down for that. All right, and then we have our peppermint one. Just spilt on me. Will you hold? Sure. On display. Oh, I just got milk all over my phone screen. <laughs> I um, have the top. It looks cute. The what? The top looks really yeah, cute. Yeah, it does. It's, I didn't expect that. Is it sprinkles? 
It's um, crushed candy cane. Starbucks is really pulling it out. They know what to do. Um, our decadent cafe mocha is infused with peppermint for a bright burst of minty chocolatey joy. It's finished with luscious layers of whipped cream, mocha drizzle, and colourful candy cane sprinkles for a truly magical masterpiece to cool you down and keep you going all summer long. We love that. Mm. I don't think if I needed cooling, this would be my first um, favorite. My it first sawdust. Yeah, it's like I don't want to. Like I like peppermint flavored things, but like I don't think I like it as a milk. Like I <laughs> like. <laughs> <laughs> like as a, I couldn't drink a whole thing of that. You know? Yeah, it just tastes like those mint slice biscuits. Mm. But like, I'm drinking it. Yeah, it's... Oh, wow. Like, it's not bad. No, it's not bad. I reckon I could drink a whole one and then I'd hate myself afterward. Yeah. Like, whereas the toffee nut, if I drank the whole thing, I'd probably be like... Yeah, like needed poop, but I'll be up like a you know, like, I'd be, be okay happy. About yeah, it. whereas yeah. this I'd be like uh, all day afterwards. Yeah, and if you felt kick about it, you'd expect to feel kick because it was so strong. I'm sure is obviously the clear winner. <laughs> it's my favorite Christmas <laughs> beverage. No, <laughs> it happened. It's not the same. Oh, I just all. like flicked milk everywhere as well. Like I want to try. Where did they be similar? Like I'm sure someone after you us just wanted more toffee. I don't know. Have more toffee. I don't like candy cane, so that tastes <laughs> not nice to me. <laughs> exactly what you signed up for, but we knew it wasn't going to be a good time. Hmm. Do you want to do a swapsies? Sure. Yeah. I think I like this more. The only other, the only other time I've ever had this hmm? is when I ordered a toffee nut and they gave me a gingerbread mocha. I mean, a peppermint mocha. So they clearly just don't know what they're doing. Mmm. I don't know what they are. Like they taste like sweet cornflakes. Sweet cornflakes, okay. And what is toffee nut? Well, is, is that is it toffee? Is it toffee nut on top? Maybe. Or is it just a flavour? Find out. <clears throat> hey Siri, <laughs> what is toffee nut? Is toffee nut basically like caramel? Starbucks, Reddit. I mean, I read this Reddit thing <laughs> says. I want to try a latte with the toffee nut syrup only because the advertised drinks usually mix it with mocha. Well, it pretty much just tastes like a caramel drink. This per the wandering barista replied, sort out, but better. It will turn your drink up to 11. For some reason, I've fallen deeply in love with toffee nut and I've been singing its praises to anyone and everyone. It's what the caramel syrup wishes it was. I hate to say it, but toffee nut is bae. You know what I hate? <laughs> <laughs> Reviews. <laughs> sure, I'll say hey, and it gives me PTSD from when I was a kid. I'm not upset at you about it at all. Because I'm actually fine. <laughs> but when people what, stir the kiss, kiss, the yeah, destroy the cream I was, in the drink. I was say I that mean, too. My mum used to be like, can I have some? <laughs> I was going to say it before when I said it. I was like, oh, I really ruined the decoration. No, nah, it's fine. I'm actually not fine. Sometimes it does taste minute. better, but I think it's more the, the, the lack of control that I have. <laughs> <laughs> like. Really, I don't know. It's, I think it's just trauma. Also, can you get into the camera and look in it with your drink for my thumbnail? Sure. <laughs> Peppermint one, I would say it's like a seven out of ten. I'd say a smart, maybe an eight. Mm. But I'd say a smart, like the higher end of good, but it's not perfection. Seven point five. Well, yeah. Average it out. Average. Toffee nut. What do you think? Oh, like an eleven. Like yeah, it's really good. <laughs> Have a, I love these. Yeah, okay, cool. They can come. Matcha? What do we rate the matcha? <laughs> <laughs> I was, it's also a bigger size than what we asked for. I thought maybe they put it in a bigger cup because of the cream. But it's, they've just given us like a free, huge matcha. I don't want it. Okay. If it's not a gingerbread latte, I don't want it. I just have no understand. Like, that's just not nice. And it's, it's not, not. That, like, I understand people have different taste buds. Mm -mm. Fully understand that. But, like, who likes that? 
that tastes how like roasted seaweed smells and you know what i don't want with roasted seaweed milk <laughs> <laughs> We just went back in and got the correct drink. So we finally have a gingerbread latte. Ginger hey? oh, I've got to read the thing. Oh, yes. <clears throat> I, if it doesn't say notes of cinnamon, I'm going to be very upset. Inspired by everyone's favorite Christmas cookie, the sweet and spicy flavors of gingerbread are the perfect match to our bold espresso. A cinnamon and infused whipped cream <gasps> is then lovingly drizzled in golden rainbows of brown sugar sauce. Oh. That sounds good. I thought you were excited because it said notes of and I was excited. But... Did it say notes of? No, it said uh, I'm infused with. Oh no, sorry. I did. <laughs> uh, do you want to try this? No, you can go first. My lipstick's going to go over the thing. Sorry. I can take the lid off if you want. It's so fine. Oh, it's so good. 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 Yeah, that's nice. No? I don't get hot um, drinks from Starbucks very often, so I'm excited. There you go. It's nice because I got a little bit of whipped cream first and then the drink to follow. That is nice. And I also feel like, what time is it? It's like 7.30 and I've been craving a coffee for hours, so. It's not super it's, sweet either, which is good. No. Like it feels like you're drinking a coffee, not like you're drinking, like. Mm. I think I get a headache if I drink the whole thing though. Really? Maybe it's not sweet, like it's not sweet, sweet, but like. Like it's not my, it's not just a normal coffee. Yeah, I don't know. Mm -hmm. It's making my mouth very warm. Like <laughs> <laughs> it's just a sunburn. <laughs> Maybe. Um, what do you rate that? Um, I think I give it like an eight. I do like it, but I think I'd like it as a frappuccino. More. Yeah. But I'm a very I like a cold drink. Yeah. So, what do you rate it? Um, I reckon, yeah, a 7 or an 8, maybe 7.5. 7 yeah. I also like the cup, though. Yeah, I do like the cup as well, and I do like that they gave us a bigger size again. Yeah. But, um, don't. I like that when I went in, I was like, hi, she goes, what was wrong with it? And I was like, we were back, we were here like half an hour ago. <laughs> it's not like you just saw me at the window when I came in. Like, I love how the girl who was like, oh, something's wrong. I'm like, <laughs> like sorry <laughs> you, you put seaweed in my cup <laughs> like that's not a that's not a a simple mistake it's like it's such a clear mistake it's too because it's like on the thing it's gingerbread latte inside it is green it well at least i was right like when we we're driving off i was like it does look kind of green inside yeah. but maybe it's the cup but it was not the cup oh well let's wrap it up here thank you for watching and yeah that's all i have to say like and subscribe follow my socials <laughs> in the description below <laughs>